guys, funny story. <laughs> I actually started this vlog by saying it's the next day. So with that in mind, you might have a few questions. What'd you film the day before? I didn't film anything. Why did I start by saying it's the next day? That is for me to know. I just like, I really like being mysterious. So you may never know. I like to, uh, I like to present the energy of being in the middle of a task, always. I love to always be in the middle of a task. That's what I want. That's how I want to be perceived. Just keep that in mind. It's the next day. It's the next day, loves. And all I've got to say is bing bang boom. You know what I mean? Why do I look like this? Is this what I look like? Anyway, we went to the Melrose Trading Post, which is like this big outdoor market, which was really cool. And I'm so excited because look what I found. You know how I was saying I was like dissatisfied with the art on my walls because it wasn't giving me my Oklahoma bedroom energy. And what was my Oklahoma bedroom energy? Two things, wood frames, paintings of deer and other, you know, large dog shaped horse, forest horses. What, what? Anyway, look what I freaking found. I saw this and literally gasped out loud and ran up to it. And I was like, I'm buying this. Don't care how much it is because the Melrose Trading Post is like a little overpriced. Guess how much this was? $18. Satisfies my cheap ass and all two boxes that I have to get art. I'm just like really excited about it. So that's that. Um, and now, you know what time it is. Mmm, I really want a freaking burrito, so I'm gonna get one of those. Hey, kitty. All right, class, please get out your pencils and a clean sheet of paper. It is now time for a word from our lovely sponsor. Please discuss the included metaphors by the author below. You know what that means. What does it mean? This video is sponsored by Skillshare. Yay! Because Skillshare is keeping our lights on. <laughs> that was good. Hello, everybody. As you can tell by my accent, I know a lot. Speak really quickly for me. Yes, you watching. Hmm. I'm gonna say, with that accent, you don't know very much and I can help, don't you worry. With Skillshare, the online learning platform, they've got billions, not literally billions, but a lot of classes online that you can take in video format, which is ideal for people to learn. You know what I mean? They've got all kinds of classes. I've taken classes about bartending. <laughs> bartending. <laughs> I've taken classes about House plants. I took a class about productivity. Did I implement any of the things I learned? No, but I took the class and I learned. And I'm currently watching a class called Film Lighting Made Simple by my girl Dan Dan Lu. I'd be learning about light, key light, fill lights, the back light. The first 1,000 kitties to use the link in my description get a free trial of Skillshare Premium. What do you have to say about that Wednesday? Thank you Skillshare for sponsoring this video. I am on the hunt for the best authentic burrito in Los Angeles. You guys hear that? Let me pretend I do not hear what I am hearing. Anyway, I asked my friend Christelle to recommend me a spot and she was like, I know this place in North Hollywood. And I was like, I'm not in North Hollywood. Instead, what about what kind of burrito should I get? And she was like, you should try lingua. And so I ordered a lingua burrito and I'm really excited. I've never actually had lingua, which is cow tongue, which is gonna be really interesting. I don't think I've ever tried tongue, but I'm really excited to. I love, 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 love food. Like trying new weird foods. I always was eating weird shit in Korea. So I'm so excited because I was like craving a burrito. In the meantime, do you want to see the clothes I got from the Melrose Trading Post today? Set this here. <gasps> All right, the first shirt I got is 
This is like a beach shirt and I love like loose flowy shirts. So this is really fun. And the material is like, I don't know if you can tell. It's like, it's interesting, but it's really light. And it's just like fun and silly. And it has like all these postcards on it. And it's like kind of cheesy, but I mean like I would wear it with this stuff and it like doesn't look cheesy and I'm really excited. And then I also got, this Levi's like denim outer shirt, which is cool. Look at that, not too bad, right? This is what I got. Um, the guy whose stand at the Melrose Trading Post that I was shopping at, it was super windy today and all of his racks like knocked over and I helped him, you know, like pick up his clothes and hang them back up. And since I helped him, he gave me a really big discount on this stuff. So this was only like 15 bucks and I think this was 25, which is way more expensive than the thrift stores that I buy from in Oklahoma. But <laughs> as Amy told me when I was complaining, you're in the big city now, baby. <laughs> so I have to get used to thrifting not being crazy cheap, just being like more affordable than normal clothes. I'm sure I'll get used to it. But I really like these stuff and 15 bucks is not much for denim. And then 25 is a little pricey for this, but I really like it and I know I'll wear it 25 times. So that's a dollar per wear. Having a great day. The weather is beautiful. In Oklahoma, it's negative seven right now. Outside my sister's apartment, they're literally shoveling snow. Meanwhile, in LA, <laughs> clear, beautiful blue sky and a child screaming outside of my apartment, so. Burrito! Burrito, she's dense. Nappies, absolutely no clue. Limes and three salsas. Fuck yes! What do we got in here? <gasps> Ooh, a grilled pepper and grilled onions. Oh my god, I'm also really excited to try cow tongue. Hope it's delicious. Hmm, interesting. Okay. It tastes very much cow -y. So I did hate the burrito and threw it out. I'll try anything once, but now I know. Lang was not my thing. Well, oh, look how pretty that is. Maybe langra from a different place would be good, but that burrito tasted like how a cow smells, if that makes sense. Being from Oklahoma, I smelled many a cow every day of my life. Can think of few days when there wasn't a cow within a 10 mile radius of me. So anyway, I hated it. Oh my God, my date's waiting outside to pick me up. This is gonna be crazy. Hey. Holy shit. <laughs> Guys, Levi got in today. I haven't told him anything yet, but sorry, just I got my card. If you embarrass me, I'll show your license plate in this vlog. <laughs> um, okay, well it's HJJJ. No, HJJJ or JJJ four four seven. Did you or did you not put my ass cheeks on oh, I just public did. social media? I just did, but I actually. I hate waiting for people in my car, so it, it was a good, you know, payback. I do too, so I don't know why I do that to you. Yeah, it's... I usually wait a minute because you're usually late. That's... No, yeah, that's true. Last time you got here, I did check your location and you were actually three streets down the road, parked. <laughs> <laughs> and I... <laughs> Sometimes I have to be on my phone. Well, so and then I checked your Instagram story and you were filming in your car. <laughs> so, Ew, that's, so forgive sorry. me if I didn't believe you when you said here. <laughs> oh, that's really funny. Uh, that sucks. Yeah, can you back up a little bit so we can see pretty girl? Hey, pretty girl. Oh, hey, pretty baby. Hey, baby. Hey, a bit of beep and good girl today. Oh, yeah, Are you good. flirting with us oh. today? Oh, that's a good girl. Yeah, oh, been, baby, you're being a good girl today. I've been thinking about moving to LA to become an actor. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to explain that joke and why it's really funny? Um, the hilarity of it. <laughs> yeah, just explain why it's so funny. <laughs> um, Levi has these two jokes yeah. that he likes to say. Mm -hmm. The first one is, he'll call me, like, no, no, here's why I hate the joke. It says he'll text me, like, Please, please, please call me back. Like, this is so important, it's so important. And like, I'll literally drop whatever I'm doing <laughs> and like be like, oh shit, Levi needs me. I'll call and then he's like, I'm just- I think she's like underplaying it. Like, I'll really make it be urgent. Yeah. And then he'll be like, I just, I think I just, I need to move to LA, be an actor. And 
when I tell you, I like. Oh my god! Look at us doing a little spin. <laughs> I could, like, I could murder in that moment. The second one, he's well, probably gonna do that. Well, too. also, this first bit that is actually not a joke. I have been thinking about it, but it's I do live in LA and I am I am becoming an actor. That's yeah. the, that's the punchline. The punchline is that that's all we talk about no, ever. That's why it's funny though. <laughs> it's hilarious. Yeah, that's why we that oh how we laugh. I know how we giggle, giggle, giggle every time. You see and where we are? Why don't you tell them the second time? Well, this is Silver Lake. And what's crazy about Silver Lake is actually, if you look at it, you can tell that it is silver. Silver. Do you so, know that? And that's the second joke. <laughs> yeah. And I gave him a fake laugh the first time he did it. Yeah. He, a sincere fake laugh where he wouldn't have known that I didn't find it funny. You know what? Who I said it I said the silver like 120 roommates and they gave me like a genuine real solid laugh. I think it was Kaylin and Nadia both. And that was really validating to me. And I'm really happy that they did that for you. However, I gave you <laughs> Look, after they cracked up, I looked over to you and you were like <laughs> Um and I'm happy to give you like one to two fake jo laughs on the same joke. Sure. But I think now we're pressing upwards of at least 40 times that you've said that joke. Uh, do you think we're there? Do you think we're at 40? Um, I'd say I would confidently say 40. I would too. Uh, you wanna walk? <laughs> Corny goes, hey, I got a good joke for your vlog. Okay. So let's hear it. Guys, we've been walking and the people behind us won't stop following us. <laughs> <laughs> After we grill your ass for your joke, <laughs> I think that was. That's a new house. Dead ass. Yeah, that's a new house. Okay. Oh, my God, and the one next to it. Oh, we've walked around Silver Lake together specifically, maybe. <laughs> that was pretty good. <laughs> that was pretty good. Ask me something. Oh. <laughs> okay, no, that's really funny. Okay, so I'll say, um, I'm gonna hit it. Um, I'm gonna ask you something, and then you take off. Okay. Hey, guys, I'm gonna push there. Are you doing okay? <laughs> and then after that, do you want to get me hot scotch in? I don't want to get you hot scotch. Do you want to get maybe a bit? <laughs> <laughs> um, do you want to tell the people where, who, what this home is? What does this home mean to you? No, that's not a good joke. I actually don't want that in there. Okay. <laughs> Look how pretty. <gasps> it's literally silver. Are you saying it's not? It's called Silver Lake. Where are you going? Hey everyone, comment down below if Levi should be insecure as fuck or not. <laughs>